that time again, Magic Video of the Week. My name is Kurt Anderson. You guys are awesome. Last week, for the first time, I taught you how to do a magic trick and asked that you share it with your friends. I got tons of new subscribers. It got a lot of views right away. And this week, do the same thing. Remember to subscribe if you haven't. If you have, pass it on to your friends. Let's see, I'm looking at my computer here. The JP Karam really loved the trick. He liked it even before he found out how to do it. Thought figuring it out and me teaching it was even a bonus so he could share his friends. Also, uh, Fatima101101 loved the trick. There's a bunch of other comments. I read all of your comments, so if you post below, I'll read them and I might mention you next week. This week, I've got a special guest with me, Leah Holloway. Leah, we're gonna do a magic trick using nothing but your imagination. So before we start, I'm gonna take this paper and I'm gonna write a prediction, okay? So I'll write the prediction right here. Okay, so I have my prediction. I'm gonna put it right there. So here's what we're gonna do. I told you it's a trick with nothing but your imagination. So I want you to reach into an imaginary pocket and pull out three imaginary coins for me. Okay, and what do you have? A quarter dime and a nickel. A quarter dime and a nickel. Okay, um, I want you to pick any one of those and put it back in your pocket. The dime. Okay, and we're going to use one of the two following coins that you have. You have a quarter and a nickel left. Uh, hand one to me. Quarter. Okay, so we'll use the quarter. You can put the nickel back. So we've got the quarter here. I'm going to take the quarter. I'm going to flip it up in the air and hit. Now, is the quarter on heads or tails? Tails. Okay, now this is what's funny. You went through all of this and you didn't even look. As a matter of fact, you shut your eyes. And see, here's the thing. I knew you were going to pick a quarter. I knew it was going to land on heads and you were going to say tails. Because the quarter is actually on heads. Look, you can see it's actually on heads, isn't it? I can prove it. Do you remember I made a prediction before we started? Turn that over and read the prediction. The quarter is actually on heads. And we'll show this to the camera. The quarter is actually on heads. It's not tails, and I knew it all along. How, do you, how did you do that? I honestly have no clue. That's my magic video of the week. Thank you, Leah, for helping out. Thank you. Don't forget to subscribe, share the videos with others, and I'll see you next week.